Now to the future of Fort Worth. Some of the candidates running to be the city's new mayor took part in one of the largest forums before Election Day. Our political reporter Jack Fink focusing on what the candidates had to say. With hundreds of people watching, four of the ten candidates running for Fort Worth mayor discussed where they stand on the issues relating to businesses. Tarrant County Democratic Party Chair Deborah Peoples, Councilmember Ann Zeta, Maddie Parker, former Chief of Staff for current Mayor Betsy Price, who's retiring, and Daniel Caldwell took part in today's forum. They were each asked about recent headlines involving CEOs who've criticized election bills being considered by state lawmakers and how it would impact them as mayor. Anytime your CEOs are speaking up out of concern, we have to listen, especially in a city that is trying to grow jobs and economy. It saddens me every day to see the limited amount of people that participate in our voting process. And so anything that limits that is something that we should stand up and speak very loudly about. I know what businesses are looking for, and anything that limits diversity and inclusion is bad for business. And as your mayor, I'm going to be out representing everyone. He can discourage the legislators from passing restrictions to uh, the ease of voting, but he cannot directly pass much in the way of policy. That the candidates were also asked what they can do to attract entrepreneurs to the city. So I was in five different communities yesterday visiting with small businesses and talking about how we highlight them. And I said, what would happen if we had some public art here to drive people into the neighborhood? And we've been partnering with Visit Fort Worth to highlight all of the neighborhoods in our city as well. Um, because that is a tourist attraction. It's everything from biotech, um, media and film, arts, restaurateurs, technology. You need an accelerator in each of those categories that is well funded, both nonprofit, public private partnerships. Election day is Saturday, May 1st. Early voting begins this Monday. Arlington and Plano are electing new mayors as well. Jack Fink, CBS 11 News. Jack, we thank you for the insight. And you can watch interviews that Jack did with some of the candidates. They're posted on our website right now, cbsdfw.com. If you do a forward slash and then Jack Fink interviews, it'll take you to everything he has right there.